federal government threatens U.S. firm accuses Twitter of polarizing Nigeria, alleges mission suspicious. This is on page two, and this is also a major talking point. Mm. So people expect, Nigerians have been expecting that President Buhari does more, he talks more, and addresses the nation, takes action. Now he, he actually <laughs> said something, and people are against him. Is, is Was I wrong? Is that being autocratic, like people said? Yeah, it's, enough. it's not about talking more, it's about what you're saying, yeah. you know. And, uh, uh, you know, that's what I was saying, that more of the reactions than the, the essence of the conversation, mm. uh, indeed. Uh, the, the president came out talking tough. That was the first time in a while that, yeah. you know, there were some Nigerians who really were happy. Yes, he that has woken up from his mm -hmm. slumber, you know. Uh, he said that the people who are trying, who are burning in neck offices, uh, that uh, it, will come, it will shock them, you mm -hmm. know, and all that. But we live in the social media time. And then President Buhari and the Nigerian government does not own Twitter. Twitter is, is an open social media, mm -hmm. uh, a site where people air their opinions mm -hmm. and carry out conversations about how uh, Twitter have rules. Mm -hmm. You know, if you violate all your rules, they, 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 they have the power to bring your tweet down. I even close your account completely. Mm -hmm. You know, they did that to Donald Trump. Oh, that's, yeah. A, yeah. that's a president, the president of the biggest and strongest country on earth. Uh, you know, he tweeted and they say, we don't like you to violate our rules. Mm -hmm. We bring it down. He complained. He closed his account. Mm -hmm. You know, this is how Twitter operates. You know, we must be able to engage them on the terms of their of their own rules. Now, what did the president say? Uh, did those comments. Let me just be part of it. He said many of those uh, misbehaving today are too young to be aware of the destruction and loss of lives that occurred during the Nigerian Civil War. Mm -hmm. Those of us in the fields for thirty months. Who went through that went through the war who would treat them in the language they understand the message was good until the last line the language we would treat understand. them in the language they understand people found that offensive they found it a repeat of the genocidal statements you know that truly nigerian oh, civil war yes. where many people were killed is that the language he means yeah. so people report to twitter and twitter looked at it and under their own rules and feels these values are rules and, mm -hmm. they, and they brought it down and they brought the tweet down and removed it from the president's post. Mm -hmm. This is simple. And I, I hear Mr. Mr. Lai Mohammed, the Minister for Information, yeah. complain bitterly, accused Twitter yeah. of being of different rules for different people, mm -hmm. talked about Namdi mm -hmm. And I sit here and I'm sure that not one Nigerian government official that works in the media, in the presidency, the Minister of Information, that has engaged Twitter once, mm -hmm. you know, on Namdi Kano streets. I'm not sure. If they have, then Twitter will also have brought down a lot of tweets by Namdi Kano because now they can also make this kind of statements statements that are deemed you know uh, are out of control insightful mm -hmm. and non-accommodating if you twitter can't just wake up and understand everything that's happening in Nigeria. yeah okay. they, you have to report it if you don't report it no twitter won't care mm -hmm. you know that's why in the first place the president tweet even came out in the first place mm -hmm. you know because twitter doesn't know that uh this might be offensive once people reported them it and they now measured it under their rules and yeah. say this falls foul of our rules okay. and then bring it down I think government should understand what is happening in the world today. It is a social media frenzied era we live in. Mm -hmm. You know, you cannot control things the way you used to. You know, with one hand, one snap of a finger, you close down the radio station, arrest the editors, and put them in jail, or go to a newspaper house, or even go and buy your police papers no. in the stand. These days, <laughs> from the comfort of your room, crossing your legs, you are right there in the middle of the world. And the social media that's making it happen. And Twitter is perhaps the biggest news social media source in the world today. Mm -hmm. Before anybody even says anything, sometimes you think it, you tweet it. Mm -hmm. That's what happens. Before anybody even calls a press conference, mm -hmm. issues a statement, begin a debate about an issue, they throw it on Twitter first. Because you can do that in five in five words, you know. Yeah. So that's why Twitter is that big and that engaging. You know, I, I see like Mohammed's argument about answers as well. Did yeah. the government really complain okay. to Twitter? The government need to not to create a department that will have to engage on social media. At the moment, they don't. So I don't, I don't think they should be complaining, you know, unless you want to close down Twitter in this country. In China, there's no Twitter. They have their own uh, messaging uh, app. Yeah, messaging app like Twitter. Yeah. Do you want to be a country like China, mm. you know, and 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 block Twitter completely in our country? If you do that, you know the risk you're running. But for this comment by the president, a lot of people deemed it offensive. They reported to Twitter. Twitter did his work. So if the Nigerian government is very unhappy about Nam Khan and some of his comments and other people, then just simply report, report it. You know, but I'm sure that the Nigerian government doesn't even know how to engage with hmm. Twitter. All right, it's time to read your messages. Did you enjoy this video? Hit the subscribe button for more. Leave a comment and like. Thank you.